Good morning friends. I am going to dwell upon the quote Tough times never last. Tough people do. I have chosen this keeping in view the present COVID-19 scenario. Dr. Robert Sculler has written a book on the same title and it has been a bestseller ever since and has motivated numerous people to come out of tough situation. Friends, it's a fact that toughest of stones are broken by the last stroke of hammer. The winner of a race is decided by the last yard of the track by a fraction of a second. The invention comes into being after a lot of failures. Therefore, those who give up midway in their struggle will never be winners. If I may say, perseverance is the key word. Keep trying, that's what the champions are made of. They have to overcome many tough situations, but they never give up. That means tough situations or times are temporary, so it never lasts. But in normal situations or even in the hardest situations, some people never give up. So they are called as tough people who are highly dedicated and become tougher than the situations. Coming on to the present COVID-19 scenario, the initial reaction is lockdown to break the chain so it does not spread beyond control till we have a fair idea of how to avoid it and cure it. In present tough times, survival is the keyword. Cleanliness is the lifesaver. Miserly use of available resources is going to get you through tough times. Those tough people who adhere to all restrictions are more likely to come out of these situations unscathed. Contrary to this, there are people called Covidiots who do not listen to the government rules and move out without a cause. They are the cause of spreading the virus that not only puts the strain on the medical facilities but also endanger the other people around them. Tough times call for tough, tough decisions. People have to sacrifice their freedom, their earning and engage in charitable work. So far, India has done tremendously well compared to developed countries like USA and European countries. It is because we have full faith in God. It is only a matter of time that a cure or a vaccine will be invented. Meanwhile, we can all take preventive actions and take a diet which is healthy and improves our immunity. We can stay motivated by reading good books while staying at home, do indoor yoga to keep ourselves fit, spend quality time with our parents and siblings, and cultivate good habits. In the end, I would like to conclude by saying that only well-disciplined and tough people will come out of this pandemic unscathed